Hello everyone, this is Dragon playing Destiny 2 and on this video I want to tell you a few things that you need to know if you are doing the challenge on the second encounter of the raid on Master difficulty. The challenge is the same for Legend and Master, where the runners can only take one symbol at a time inside the rooms. On Legend, you can have multiple runners for the challenge, but on Master, you will need two players to run inside and do the symbols, two players need to be on add control, and two players are going to do the stunning on the caretaker. The players on add control will need an overload mod and weapon to deal with the overload champions that spawn on each side. There are going to be around 5 on the right side and on the left side and this will remain on every floor. I recommend using the Lucent Finisher mod to finish those champions and getting heavy for yourself and this will also be helpful for your teammates. Once the damage phase is over, before going to the next floor, they can grab all the heavy that should be lying around and be ready for the next phase. If you're going to be stunning, don't forget to help shooting down the flying pasta and sometimes you might want to double check if you need to help on add control. There are no shielded enemies on this encounter, so feel free to use any weapon type that you want but do have someone with divinity for the damage phase. I think that it goes without saying that warlocks with well of radiance are more than welcome and titans should place the bubble between two different plates so everyone can get weapons of light for the first plate and then again when they run towards the second plate. If you do the challenge on master difficulty and then you do the challenge on normal, you will still get double rewards but none of them are going to be pinnacle but you still get a chance to get a red border weapon if that's what you're looking for. So that's it, I think that this challenge is way easier than the one from last week, you get an adept weapon and doing all challenges on master are required if you're looking to get the seal. Alright guys, don't forget that I will be giving away Destiny 2 Silver soon, more on that on the video description, but for now, enjoy the grind and I'll see you in the next video, bye.